everyone, it's your lovely Abby Dagren, and welcome back to my channel, lovelies. Today I will be finishing the series that I began with Midheavens. Today I'll be doing the last one, which is Aquarius Midheavens. I'll be speaking on the reputation, the career, and the occupations that someone can go into based off of someone with an Aquarius Midheaven. So please stay tuned for the rest of my video, lovelies. If you have not yet become a part of the Abby Dagren family, then this is your calling to do so. Please make sure you hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell so you know when I upload videos on the daily. Also, please make sure you share this video with everyone you know, whether it's your friends, your family members, your enemies, anyone in general who is an Aquarius Midheaven or who really loves Midheavens. And last but not least, please make sure you hit that like button because I know you guys will love this video. Now let's speak on Aquarius Midheavens. So, well let's talk about Midheavens first. So your Midheaven has to do everything with your reputation, your career, and how you appear in public in regards to your Midheaven. So I know a lot of people speak about your rising sign, that's how you appear to the world without even speaking. But this one has to do with your career, how people see you in the workplace, or how people see you in the job that you're at. This is how people know you and also how they perceive you. So they may know you based off of your midheaven energy. Your midheaven rules your 10th house, so it's ruled by Capricorn, which means success, status, and reputation. So having your midheaven shows you where you will be successful at, your status, your reputation, and what sign you will need to use in order for you to get that. Also, how you gain money. That's why a lot of people tie it to your career because this is the way or this is the energy you will need to use in order to make the money you will need to make. Also, when you look at your midheaven, you're able to see how your north node will be manifested. So, in order for you to manifest your north node to a complete way, you will need to look at your midheaven and the med heaven that you have, you will need to use that energy in order for you to accomplish your north node. Now let's speak on Aquarius midheaven. So if you have an Aquarius midheaven, you're going to have a lot of Aquarius themes, a lot of Aquarius energy, and a lot of Aquarius patterns. They tend to be very unique people with this placement, very innovative, very creative, and they're the types of people that when they are no longer alive, people will really look at their career and look at their life and really think to themselves, wow, they really did that and they were really able to accomplish every dream or accomplish everything that they're meant on this earth to do. There's so much to this placement that's very important, especially the fact that they they love to create things and they love to be very productive. They're the type of midheaven that loves to pave their own way. So they're the type of person who will create their own job because they don't really like working for anyone like that. Like working is cool, but you know, working for anyone is something that they do not really prefer. So they're the type of person that will create their jobs, whether it's a job for a lot of people or just for themselves. They're going to pave their own way and anything that they pave is very unique. They're not going to have the most traditional job, like a job like a doctor, a lawyer, or a housekeeper, or a nurse, or just anybody that's a traditional job. They're not that's not the type of job they like. They love to think outside the box. They love to get into an occupation that is something they made. They're the type of people that love to get into online things, tech, digital, because you know, they're very innovative and they love to think about the future. They love to think about things that other people do not think of. So they're very tech savvy and they love to go into technology. They're the types of people who may create an app 
and these apps will be used for beneficial reasons they might be someone who creates something that people have been longing to create or thinking of a change but they just are the ones who actually create that change so they love to change a lot of their careers so even though they may go into one career they may change it and go into another one and at times people can be confused as to what they do because they just do so many different things and this kind of correlates with the Gemini midheaven as well and they're the type of people who create their own success they don't need someone to help them with their success they're the type of people who are created themselves and just know that they can do it and they just have like a vision in their mind to know what to do and what not to do in, in that way in regards to their midheaven and Aquarius. They're the type of people who may create a lot of things in regards to humanity. So they're the type of people who will see an issue and think to themselves, how can I change this? How can I fix this? And with their innovative tools and their innovative mind and thinking, they're the type of people who will make sure that they create something to help humanity. They're also the type of people who are humanitarians. They love to help people and they love to give back to their community and they love to give back to society in general. They're also the type of people who love to uplift others. So whether it's through their products or whether it's just by a word of encouraging thought, they're going to be that person in your life in regards to your career who's going to uplift you and make you know that you can do anything you want the sky is the limit and they're going to make sure that they accomplish that goal and helping you accomplish that goal in that way so the reputation that they get is that they're unpredictable at times and not in a bad way because sometimes you're like what is this person going to do next like you're just interested in this person who has this midheaven you want to know what they're going to do next like what's up What's the next career they're going to go into? What's their next move? Because they're just always on the go and they're just so interesting. They're also going to get the reputation of being very different. So other people are going to be like, wow, this person is not a person who goes with the flow or who goes with the crowd. They love to do their own different things. And they're just very unique. Another thing is that they're a creative genius. They're the type of people who will create things or fix things that no one else was able to fix or create. And they get that reputation of just being a creative person and a genius at anything that they put themselves through. They're also the person who's not going to box themselves and they're always going to think outside the box and try their best to create something for the future in order to benefit everyone. Another thing is they love communicating. They love to communicate what they want, what they need, what they think is best for society or what they think is best for themselves, what they think is best for their company if they run one. So communication is something that you're always going to get from them and you're always going to know what they want and what they don't want because they're going to communicate that with you. Next up is that they're very community minded. So Aquarius, they're the type of people who are very community. And that's something that comes with their occupation as well. A lot of the things or a lot of the products they make is going to be community minded as well because they're going to see how can this help everyone in society? How can this help this community? How can this help that community? And that's something that they will always look at before doing things because they want to make sure that everyone will benefit from the project or the innovation that they're bringing. Up next is the careers I believe someone with this placement should have. First would be going into the tech industry. They love technology, they love things that will advance society. So having this placement or having this occupation would make sense because not only do they think for themselves and think outside the box, but they're also helping society in a way that is very beneficial for it. Up next is an app creator. Creating an app is something that is up their alleyway and that's something that they would be great at because they know what to do and what not to do and what's the best to create. Up next would be going into computer science. That's something that they would love to do. Another thing would be astrology, engineering, politics, fashion designers and politics because they want to make sure that everyone is perfectly fine they have a community mind and that 
laws are made for everyone equally and that everyone is treated well with these laws. That's all I have for you lovelies today in regards to Aquarius Midheaven. I hope that you love this series. I hope that you learned a lot about Aquarius Midheaven. If you have one, please let me know down below in the comment section. Did you learn more about it? Did you get a better understanding of it? Also, please make sure you hit that subscribe button, that notification bell. And please let me know what other series you would like me to do next week. Um... Please share this and hit that like button. Please follow me on all of my social media accounts from my Pinterest, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat, everything. Just please follow me on all of them. Also, please support my PayPal and as well as my SD store. I love you all. Please stay safe and healthy. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, lovelies.